Hi, Gemini. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. So, Gemini, it looks like a decision needs to be made. But you don't have all the facts. There will be some surprise that comes to you. Something surprising or surprise message. There's a need for somebody to be a little bit more emotionally mature. And maybe even someone needs to be more romantic, you know, in order to push this thing forward. If it's a relationship. All right. So let's see what's going on. What do we have for Gemini? What do we have for Gemini? The star card could be dealing with an Aquarius. Some of you are, you know, you're going to get some recognition. You're going to be in the public light. People are going to be looking up to you. People see you. People see uh, what you have to offer. Um, there's like guidance and hope and maybe even finding your way or you help people find their way. Um, you get your messages uh, from the spiritual realm with all that purple there. Um, some type of um, spiritual royalty. Uh, maybe, you know, you have high ranking in the spiritual realm here. Um, you got some spirit guides speaking to you. You've fully accepted your gifts, okay? And maybe some of you are on the path of releasing old baggage, clearing here. Clear channels also to spirituality. Um, there's a lot of beauty and radiance with you. Very nice. Let's see what's going on for Gemini. Oh, the temperance card in the judgment. Ooh, nothing but majors. Angel, angelic presence um, to help you look over how far you've come. Maybe on your journey or in your journey or on your spiritual journey here. Wow. It's definitely um, something that's helping you. It, I, I want to say ascension. It can be ascension. Not exactly sure. Um, you like balancing out the energy here. You like the alchemist. It's like you know how to, you know, attune to the spiritual realm. This yeah, the spiritual the spiritual realm, and um, it's like you have out of body experience. It's like your soul is in direct communion with, you know, higher being. Yeah, the lovers, while you're showing up in your own reading. Um, soul contract here. Some of you are fulfilling it. Yeah, it's almost fulfilled. This is interesting. Um, some of you, like, this is like... Um, you could be a, a spiritual, a spiritualist, a shaman, a spiritual worker, a witch, Wiccan, wizard. Whatever this is, it's helping you get past something. It's helping you to break free of and start something new. Maybe even chart a new path, a new development. Something else is developing in your life now. For you, you've gotten over one major hurdle to now move on into new. A new new business, new love, new just new altogether. Yeah, it could be new love. You could have a lot of suitors coming towards you. You could be attracting a lot of people. You also could be taking a break from someone here because, oh, somebody, so if you're not the witchy type, you went and saw somebody who's a shaman or a witch, this is to help you in your career path. You needed some help or guidance. There was some relationship here that just is it's petty, it's argumented, 
you know, it's argumentative. It's, um, you had to take a break from this. There's also suspicion of infidelity, maybe on your part or the other person's. Somebody has now wanted to take matters into their own hands with the magician card and maybe even manifest you back, but somebody is keeping their distance. Could be you, could be another person. Could be Scorpio. All of a sudden, somebody is uh, somebody is still watching you, talking about you, gossiping about you, trying to gather information, being deceptive, maybe even following you, stalking you. All of a sudden, this person is obsessed. King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Scorpio and Pisces, obsessed with maybe catching you. They feel like you're trying very hard to get away with something or vice versa. They're trying very hard to get away with something. Interesting reading. All right, let's see what the Oracle deck has to give you, Gemini. Some of you on, on some good path. Yeah. Trying to save the marriage, trying to save my marriage. So some of you are, there's still an energy of somebody not being trusting. I love your smile. Um, someone is saying, I dumped you. Now I want you back. Please forgive me. So that, yeah, that's the energy of now someone turning into a stalker all of a sudden. Yeah. Um, that's what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website, book your reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can also, um, excuse me, donate to the channel by going over to, um, you can donate to the channel by clicking the Buy L a Coffee link. I think those are all of the announcements. Oh, oh also, you can learn the Tarot with me by clicking um, on the link in the description box. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.